Hey man, it's the ISO guy sensei, the greatest nigga on 2K in existence. And listen up man, the 2K23 builder has leaked. I've told you. Everything I've been saying about 2K23 has been correct, man. Right now, we are finna compare the new builder to the old builder, man. So make sure y'all watch this full video. You are definitely going to want to see this. So they released a screenshot about the builder, the W, all that stuff, man. We gonna talk about all that very soon. So this build right here, man, PG shooting guard, um, I'm sure you're, you're still going to be able to pick your position, you know, PG, shooting guard, small forward, etc. Advanced gathers. Um, for y'all current gen niggas, y'all don't know nothing about this, but this been on next gen. So it looks like they're going to uh, copy paste the takeovers. Um, there's like takeover abilities. If y'all didn't know, there's like three different ones for like one takeover and then it's double takeover type. Shit. And um, for current gen, if y'all didn't know, you're not going to have takeover abilities. Y'all are just going to have double takeover and just everything that that takeover does. And you could pick whatever, like 19 shit. Sound broken as shit. Game changer. I don't really know what this is. Maybe this is a new thing or maybe it's just for this W shit. Player boost. I don't know what this is. Maybe this is something new or maybe this is just buying boost. Now, team boost. I guess these are like new takeovers. Accelerator. I remember extender i remember helping hand i don't remember this seems new resilience that might be new okay so they're saying that the game changer is exclusive to the w apparently don't know if that's true or not it's 2k they're saying helping hand it gives a percentage of your takeover actions to a teammate who needs help filling their bucket so if y'all didn't know for team takeover, it, everyone has to contribute in some way. Maybe that's like getting a steal or a block or some D or some offense. I don't know. So maybe this helps that. And I'm assuming this will be a new uh, takeover perk in uh, 2K23 next year. Accelerators uh, fill the takeover meter faster. Extenders keep it uh, longer. If y'all didn't know, everyone just like used extender. That was the most OP one. Hopefully there's some more diversity in uh, 23. 2K seems to not have the ability to make things diverse. Um, one thing seems to be good and then they don't touch it for the whole year. This is what I be telling y'all, bro. Like other games, they adjust things. 2K just leaves it. It's like they don't have the ability to change shit, bro. Like they're just like ass devs. Like they're garbage devs, my nigga. Like, they don't have the ability to adjust things and tweak things. Why are you having all these different takeover perks and all this different shit and niggas is just using the same shit? Tweak shit. Not nerf shit. Make other shit better. Like, what are y'all doing? It gives more content to the creators and it makes things more fresh for the viewers. Like, this is a shit lazy company, my nigga. That ass. And it needs to be said, y'all niggas need niggas like me. So stop the hate. And make sure you subscribe if you're new. Hit that goddamn like button. Resilience minimizes the effect of a negative action that would otherwise cause the meter to decrease. This is good. Um, I've never seen this. I know when like my takeover meter gets built high and I do one wrong thing and it just all goes. I kind of hate it, but hey that's nice so let's look at this builder i'm gonna compare it to the last builder too look 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 at this so the bitch got an 80 close shot the bitch can't stand and dunk um the bitch got a 38 post control the bitch got an 87 driving layup the bitch can't drive and dunk right she got a stupid low three okay play pay close attention and the mid range you know is is is, is decent but it's not stupid high pay attention the free throw is high okay notice there's no post shit so they probably again if y'all didn't know they added like the post fade and all that post hook to your shooting i don't know which one it is particularly someone tell me down below in the comments and um, i think maybe the post hook was something in finishing i don't know i don't know exactly but yeah, this is making it to where more people can um, 
be post gods. Now the playmaking, pay attention. Pass accuracy 88, okay? The bitch got nice playmaking. 92 ball handle. Y'all ain't see Mike Wang tweaks? He said that was the, the echelon for the best uh, SIGs. 91 speed with ball. Pay attention. Now look, the bitch got shit defense. 48. What the fuck? 68 perimeter. You know, shit defense. Shit defense, right? But the bitch got nice physicals. She fast as shit, right? I don't know how tall this bitch is. I wish they would have told us. But <laughs> you see the bitch only has two things that are OP, right? Now I've been telling y'all, this is a nerfed builder. It's like the same and it's nerfed. I talked to niggas that made played the game, my nigga. The builder is nerfed, bro. The builder last year was supposed to be more nerfed than current gen. Y'all didn't even know that. It wasn't supposed to go haywire two years in a row. They done fucked it up and it became like OP type shit. But they want shit nerfed, okay? Get ready for them build videos. Nerf role playing 2K, good for my channel. <laughs> I prefer, you know, if I was just a gamer, I would prefer you know, realistic all around two-way builds. That's what I would prefer, but since I'm a YouTuber, this, I, I guess, is pulling, you know, I, I presume it would pull more. So I'm like indifferent about which one I want. Well, actually I'm not. I still want the uh, realistic two-way builds. But anywho, as y'all can see, it this could, this could mean that if you have a high layup and all that shit, you can't get a high driving dunk we're gonna try to remake this build in the um the old builder right they said the builder's gonna be way more nerfed and this definitely does look nerfed man like no defense uh shooting ass like so if you're gonna have shooting you're gonna have to go lower on some shit you know and like have nothing so you're really gonna have to pick um i guess that's what y'all want y'all let me know if y'all want role playing 2k or superstar 2k um, role playing 2K, you're gonna have to spend a lot more dollars, um, because you're not gonna have builds that could do everything you want to do in the game. So, but yeah, it's it's looking like look, you're probably gonna have to nuke your finishing to uh, get some more shooting. But this is probably the caps for the build. Anywho, let's look. Let's look at um, making a build in this shit. Uh, who we want? Who we want? These some big bitch. What that Britney Griner bitch? Man, I don't think none of these bitches can beat me. I ain't gonna hold you. Ah, drop these hoes off. We gonna pick these. Okay, create a new build. Okay, we got a god. <laughs> we got a bald bitch, young thotty. I collab with Cole before, and uh, we made some WNBA shit. You know, I made me a bald bitch, trying to go crazy. Uh, we're gonna make him a point guard. Or her a point guard. And uh, let's see, man. Let's see if we can make this build. Okay, so not this build. Ain't no slashing playmaker. Wait, hold on. Is it the slashing playmaker? Maybe it's like, it's, it's, it's tough. No, it ain't, it ain't, it ain't as close. Okay, inside out playmaker, uh, three way too high. No, two way slasher. Um, three's a little too high. The playmaking's pretty. It's pretty close. Finishing kind of there. The defense, you see the defense is way lower. And then the speed, the physicals, you know, it's way different. So like, like I've been telling you, it's way more nerfed. And another way they're going to nerf is with the badge tiers. Like you're going to have to have certain badges to get higher tier badges for, you know, there's a tier system now. So to get the best badges, you're going to have to get the other badges. So it's like it's real limiting to you and but i mean that that's what most of the community wants y'all want role players right so i mean this is gonna be like a real limiting game i don't like how like bad how op badges are anyway but i don't i i want it like in 16 there were no hall of fame badges you know it, i think that really messed up the game but now like all badges is gonna be a nerfed attributes gonna be nerfed and um yeah man you're gonna really have to depend on another guy that they're saying apparently well not really you just can't play defense yourself if you have offensive player 
Well, you can, but you're just going to have to have like a, you know, some more nerf build. Um, This is kind of close. And as you can see, the difference is it's more nerfed um, for the, the new bitch. 3 and D, no, that 3 is way too high, man. 3 level score, nah, the 3 is way too high. Offensive threat, 3 is way too high. Sharpshooter, 3 is way too high. Playmaker shot creator, 3 is way too high. Lockdown defender, okay. Now the lockdown defender is close. You know, the layup's not there. The, you get a little more layup on the new bitch. Uh, Playmaking's a little lower. But you see the defense is too high. But as you can see, man, like... It's looking kind of nerfed. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about that, man. Now, me personally, I think the W is an, is an L. It's better than my career, okay? It is way better than my career. I wish my career was like this, okay? But it's not. You don't have to pay for shit, really. You can, like, accelerate your player and get the bitch to 99 in a few hours, if that, <laughs> in, a, in, like, an hour or two, right? And it's just way better. You can play with your friends, all different type of shit. This is how my career should be. So shit I've been begging for for like hella years ago, they're actually showing that they could do it, but they're doing it with this stupid mode. This is why I don't like the mode and there's no point for it. No one's gonna play it, okay? The active user base, when this bitch come out, three people, zero people. Nigga, no one played this in 23, I promise you, bro. I tried to make videos on it. There's no one to verse what so makes you verse AIs. If there were other people, you would match up versus them. You can't play other people. So why are they making a mode to pander to this fucking feminist movement and shit? What the fuck? Nigga, just put the bitches in the game. Put the bitches in the If you want to draw in bitches or weird niggas or whatever, Put the bitches in the game. Why not have female my players? It's gonna make the user base bigger. It's gonna draw in more people. Oh, I can pick a bitch, blah, blah, blah. It's gonna intrigue. It's gonna be way more people. It's gonna create way more content, way more different type of story. And it's just gonna add, why not have the, we're playing the park. Are y'all saying bitches can't play park? So you doing this to pander. You putting in on the covers to pander and all this other shit, right? But why not have them in the game? That seems to me more fucked up than anything. You make the bitches have a whole separate mode. You saying bitches can't play park with us? We're playing the park. I don't understand. Maybe just restrict them for a pro am or some shit. Don't even restrict them. You saying bitches can't play with the niggas? They clearly can. Like, don't have no special abilities or whatever. But the bitches can play with the niggas. Why? Fortnite got bitches. Niggas be playing as bitches. Call of Duty. All these other games you could play as bitches. GTA, all that shit. Every everything. Okay, we're not in the NBA. We're not saying to add the bitches to the NBA. We're talking about online, bro, okay? It's not that big a deal. Come on. <laughs> you niggas is tripping. But maybe them showing this, maybe females is gonna be in this shit, but I don't know. Okay, so some of the rewards you'll be able to use in the city, but I'm sure they're gonna be ass. The WNBA jerseys look kinda clean. Um, I'm thinking that they're gonna let us wear these maybe uh, in the city too. Uh, they look dope. You know, they're saying they're rolling out 60 WNBA player jerseys spanning multiple seasons. Well, I mean, this probably would be just be for... These niggas are so dumb, bro. Like, look at these contact challenges. My career would be way better, nigga. Here's some in-game screenshots. Do y'all think y'all could beat these bitches one-on-one -on -one for a million dollars? I do. If y'all didn't know, for 2K23, Michael Jordan will be in that bitch. Um, y'all let me know if y'all are excited for that. They got him looking like a foo-foo boy. Come on, nigga. Michael Jordan is a masculine man. Why did, why do y'all got the nigga looking like a bitch with this shit? Y'all trying to emasculate my niggas? Like, come on. You know what? I'm a comment. And I'm gonna leave a comment on 2K. Y'all be sure to go to Twitter 
and support them hoes. Make sure y'all subscribe, drop a comment down below. It helps out the video. Drop a like, helps out the video. Turn on them post notices. Go check out my other uh, 2K23 videos, man. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome. dome.